Hey guys, welcome to the next video in the How to Speedrun No Time to Explain Remastered series uh, or series of guides. Uh, in this video, we'll take a look at the uh, third world, world sh or shotgun world, where we play as this uh, action hero kind of deal. Um, we spawn in as the laser guy because that's who we like we uh, the, the the world two three and four kind of are interconnected uh in the in the actual run uh and in the actual game um but you can enter each world independently when you want to practice um so in here we uh Shut you're up. supposed to get hit by this car to like be turned into uh to this guy who has a shotgun um, the dif the big difference with the shotgun and the laser is that it's a uh, short like burst of, of energy um, and you can can't like really correct yourself too much in the air uh, you can use the the, uh, the arrow keys like like that in the air um, which is gonna be very helpful for some of the future levels um, but you can't like shoot again afterwards like if you look at the uh the my mouse button down here you can't you can't shoot more than once um so so yeah let's uh, go ahead and restart this because there is actually a trick for this first level um unfortunately the uh the scenery behind the level changes from time from from each time you you enter um but once you are around here, like this white white line, uh, sometimes you you can line it up with uh, the the background, like like this one, this this line here. Uh, sometimes you can't. Once you're there, you want to try and aim for for landing over here uh, with the laser gun because you can skip the entire animation of the shotgun guy coming out. Um, so. Something like that. You don't actually have to go that far. You can just land here, and that will still be uh, still be better. Uh, obviously, it's best to get to, to go over here. But uh, but yeah, now you can see I, I restarted, so it will be roughly around this um, pillar here. Uh, again, this white line. Uh, if I had to to say something specific, you have the obstacle here with the white line going down to this one here, and then you just want two to the left. And it's roughly around here you want to start your shoot uh, shot. Um, you can do it a little bit later, I think. Uh, around here. Uh, but I like to do it just a little bit early. Um, so if you want to, to know exactly where the uh, the guy comes. Roughly around there. Uh, roughly around here. So if we uh, go in like that, we can uh, actually do it all the way over here. So... Much further right than, than what I said, but I just I just like to do it a little early, uh, just in case. Shut up. Something like that. Hit the uh, roof here and land here. Um, go over and into the portal. No bigger there. Um, for this one, you want to ride as you spawn in, shoot down, and then up here and just shoot into the portal. No bigger here. Well, this one is quite important that you actually uh, shoot right away because if you don't, you want to jump before um, before getting up there, and and that takes quite a bit of time. You can't, or you can barely make it, but you need to be all the way over here, uh, so you can't really make it from over there. I don't think. No, it is at least it's a lot harder. So, right as you spawn in, just shoot downwards and uh, you go to the right. Uh, something I forgot to mention is that unlike the uh, the laser, uh, you actually gain the amount of height that you jump because of the uh, single instance burst is from your current position. Um, so if we stand here, you can see we just, like, we get basically to the same height here, but if we jump, we get... In, uh, like a block higher of uh, elevation um, for, for this level you can go the, the intended path is to go down here and go up like this and into the portal it takes way too long we don't want to do that instead we go over like this 
and uh, ideally it takes a little bit of, uh, of practice to, to know the exact line. I'm gonna restart before entering the portal. Uh, but a little like steeper, I guess, than the 45 degree angle. You can do it at a 45, but then it's a little bit more risky and you might overshoot the portal. So I like to have just a little bit more height on it uh, to ensure getting into the portal like that. And of course you can uh, adjust with the uh, with the arrow keys. Um, so again, for this one, right as you spawn in, you can uh, shoot at a 45 degree angle. Just barely making it up here. Sometimes I actually miss it. It's, uh, it's not the easiest. Um, but yeah, so spawn in, move the mouse down to the left. So if we, uh, if I have it up here right now, let's see. Okay, that was uh, not the best example. <laughs> let's have it a little closer here. So something like that. Again, arrow key helps uh, quite a bit on uh, with, with this guy. Uh, here, the intended path to go down and then up. Don't want to do that. We just go over. Ideally, you go straight into the portal. I just uh, try and show that. You can even jump a little to, to help you with that. Uh, again, intended path, go this way and down. Don't want to deal with that. We go up. Uh, again, wait for, or right as the uh, as you spawn in, you can shoot down. You can actually make it up to this platform here. Uh, and then you want to do something that feels awkward every time you do it, but it's just how you do it. Uh, you walk slowly up here, <laughs> and then you jump. Um, because if you do this, you do not make it up. You simply don't. Um, so you walk up here, like just right on top of the uh, of the slope here, and then jump, and then shoot. You can make it up here. Ideally, you uh, make it all the way over, so something like this, and then you can hold left to make sure you go into the portal. Um, and uh, and yeah. So this is the uh, second to last level in this world, and uh, here you actually have to be somewhat fast because of a small trick that we just discovered like very recently, uh, which is also why you can see that my name is this long, like it's actually too long, uh, and that's on purpose that it's, it's this long, because it helps in this level. Uh, right as you spawn in, you shoot down, land up here. And then you can go to the right, and as you can see, you can actually see the name above. Uh, this is one of the only levels where you can actually go to the right of, or outside the screen to either side. Uh, you can usually go above, like outside on the, on the top. Um, but most of the levels you just die if you go too far to, uh, to the side, like, like that. Uh, so you can actually only go to the right here. Uh, I'm not sure if you can actually go too far right. Yeah, there is a... Death plane out there somewhere, but it's quite far out, so don't uh, even worry about it. Um, but yeah, be fast with the uh, with the name, and as soon as you see it be uh, below this line up here, uh, you can shoot down and uh, at a 45 degree angle. Hopefully, hit the uh, the roof. Like oh, that was a little too early. <laughs> Got trigger happy. Make sure to land here to reset the shotgun as well. By the way. And something like that. You go into there. Um, this is the last level in the shotgun world, and arguably the hardest. Um, and it, it, I don't know. I don't have any tips for this one. It's just a lot about feeling and minor corrections if you make a mistake. The first jump is very easy because it's it's so wide and open, and and you can still move with your arrow keys um, in the air. Second jump. A little steeper than 45 degree angle, I think, I would say, uh, and then correct a little bit with your arrow keys, and then the, the fat last one is, is the hardest. And if you see yourself jump a little too short, move just like a tiny bit to the left. Um, so like here, oh, that wasn't enough, move a little bit to the left, there we go. Um, and hopefully you can get down. Sometimes you can get some weird glitches where if you die here on these spikes, you spawn down here and, and weird stuff like that. Uh, if you end up landing like I did here, just shoot down into the portal like that. This is 
And uh, yeah, that's the uh, Shotgun World of No Time to Explain Remastered. See you in the next video.